he get, he got hit on the right side of the face. Is there any difference being to get the trauma on the right side of the head versus the left, or it's the same twisting? It doesn't matter. Yeah, it's it's the same twisting. It's entirely possible to have a, a brain bleed even at a distant location if the brain has moved. You know, blood vessels don't like to be stretched and torn either. Uh, if you have a direct concussion from the, the uh, a deceleration injury, uh, the brain actually goes forward and then backward. And b because something, you know, they're, they're going together and this stops, the brain's going to keep going and, and hit forward. That there's a lining, be uh, the dura matter between the, the hemispheres is called the falx cerebri. And the falx cerebri uh, in an infant is soft and pliable and flexible. And by the time they're our age, it's, it's like shoe leather. Uh, and it, it, if your brain moves forward and hits this very tough membrane, uh, you can end up having uh, the anterior connections between the right and left hemispheres damaged and decrease the relationship mathematically between function right and left frontally. Uh, co uh, uh, coherence. Uh, it, Barry Sturman uh, uses comodulation, which is more like a correlation. Uh, coherence is a little bit more complex than a simple correlation.